Okay guys, we've reached the halfway point of our stream today, so I'm going to go ahead and take a, uh, a quick 5-10 uh, to ten minute break, and uh, I'll see you shortly. Before I forget, if you like this series, if you have uh, like what I've been doing, the kind of content that I put out there, the games that I play, if you want to keep seeing me do this and you want to support, go ahead and click that subscribe button. That helps me out an awful lot so I can keep doing this kind of stuff. And uh, even if you're watching this on demand, you can just uh, find your way over to my Twitch channel. Uh, if you're over on YouTube watching this, you can uh, send me a donation, or you can uh, just click subscribe, and I will definitely give a shout out to every single person who does, because I would really appreciate it. If you can't, no worries. Enjoy the videos.
that feels pretty good. And yes, guy, we have a fancy new Be Right Back uh, background, courtesy of uh, our local our local artist, our very own Arcavius. So he made uh, he made the BRB uh, background. He made the uh, the stream will begin soon background right here. And uh, he's uh, he's actually working on some uh, emojis for us. Some personalized emojis. Oh my gosh, it's so amazing. I can't wait to get those uh, on here. I will have to figure out how to do so. So, okay, let's get back to Z game. I need to make a thanks for watching picture. Oh yeah, that'd be kind of cute. Yeah, I can just throw that up at the end. Uh, let's see. Okay, so... What is that on the counter that's purple? What? Oh, it's a, a vase? A vase with a dead flower? I think it is. Let's, let's see. Oh, it is! Yeah, it is. I wish that you could, um look at things a little bit more in detail in this game though. I didn't mean to do that. Okay. Headmaster's closet? Okay. Oh. Rattle rattle. Oh! What? <laughs> There's so many drawers! There's so many drawers in here and it only opens a single one and there's nothing in it. Okay. Well there might be something in it later. What about this? Shoes, sheets, food. Various things are stored in this room. <laughs> They're all fancy and nifty cane, as the kids say. Hmm. Okay, so I can't actually take anything? All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. I get the point. What about here? What about here? What about hat? Hat! I want to wear this top hat. I want to wear this top hat. Let me wear the top hat. Oh man. I want to be super high society. What? Oh, there was a bed in here? How did I miss the bed? Camera angle. Camera angle. I blame it on the camera angle. Okay, so what? Didn't he just have a record player in the other room? There's a record player and broadcasting equipment. Oh, is this for announcements? Oh, I guess that's all there is right here. And it's gonna block me so that I can't go... I can't peruse his literary collection. Which, oh my god, looks literally like 15 different encyclopedia uh, collections. Okay, clock says it is 7.14. Wait, 7.14? Yeah, 7.14. And then this is going to lead out to the... Okay, uh, what about... Is, will this let lead back into, like, the grand hallway? Nifty cane, I like that. Okay, so let's not go in there yet. We need to go up. White vase is to top the case. The plants are covered with dust. I probably should have said this at the beginning, but um, for anybody out there who's not familiar with my play style, I look at everything. So this is going to be kind of slow. This is going to be kind of slow. Uh, you probably already realized it by this point, and uh, if you don't like that, have already stopped watching. Just throwing it out there. Okay. A ladder. An old ladder is leaning against the wall. We might need that for something. Oh shit, I didn't pay attention to which door he went through. Um. Alright, we're gonna go through this methodically. Systematically, in fact. Ah, okay. This is the ladder doorway. Oh my god, this place is huge! Holy hell. Oh my gosh. Wait, wait, wait. Courtyard? Courtyard? Yep, that's... Th this is a courtyard. 
That's a courtyard outside. So that mansion in the fish tank is this building. Ladder? <laughs> Hardly know it. What's Jacob's ladder about? I don't want to get sidetracked by going into different hallways, but I'm okay with inspecting rooms. Holy shit, nobody sleeps in here. Oh my god, what is that? Just destroyed bedding? Is it like feathers from mattresses and, and, and pillows and stuff? Personally, that's the way I like these games, especially your playthroughs, slow and thoughtful. Aw, oh, thanks, guy. I'm glad. I'm glad there's other people who out there who do, because I'll be watching, like, somebody playing a game, and I'm like, wait, but no, you didn't look at that! But wait, no, you didn't try that! But how do I know what this says? And, and I'll be like, oh, but you didn't look at everything! So, that's what I... That's what I do, thinking that, you know, maybe there's people out there like me. Nothing, 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 nothing. A radio? Lanterns? Why is there a lantern there in 1930s? Yeah, there's... Hmm. I don't want my ignorance to show, but... Surely they didn't use lanterns so as their sole source of light in the 1930s. History, not my forte. Oh god, where is this going to lead us? Oh, what's this say? Okay, that looks like somebody's actually doing laundry around here. Shoes everywhere, suitcases everywhere. This place looks like, uh, oh, it's a, uh, Sin says it's about a Vietnam vet who returns home to a life as a, as a mail carrier, character, carrier. Suddenly demons start appearing as, and he tries to figure out why and what the army may have had to do with it. Interesting. Oh, okay, we went full circuit then. All right, all right, all right. This is connected. Let me connect it in my brain by retracing the steps. All right. There. There. Okay. Oh, wait. All right, now this one. I think this is the one the boy went in. Oh, Lord, another hallway. Toilet. Foul-smelling laundry ba baskets have been placed on the shelf. Uh, when did the war start in England, actually? Whoa, somebody, t somebody hated that urinal. Somebody was so mad at that urinal. They needed some revenge on that urinal. Oh my gosh. I'm looking this up. This is, uh, this might be important. Because if the war in England started in... When did the war... Oh, let's specify. When did World War II start in England? Oh, it did start in 1939. I thought so. I thought it was like at the end, the very end of the 1930s. And then America didn't get involved until like, what, 1942? Something? Okay, so we're still out. We're still pretty far out from World War II in this game. Are those planks of wood? Yes! Yes, they are, guy! They're, they're planks of wood! They did not have a happy pee. <laughs> what? Somebody seriously? Oh my god! What is this? This looks like scraps of metal. Holy shit. It's got the eye. It's got an eye on the seat. How peculiar. This is the boys. Obviously. Anything in here? Uh, nope. Can't see, can't see, can't see. Anything in here? I can't get it. Oh yeah, I can. Can I pull the chain? <laughs> Sin, 
Jen doesn't want to think about the last time he passed wood. <laughs> Jeez. In the urinal, guy! <laughs> Good lord. That was an angry bathroom trip. <gasps> me! What? That looks exactly like me. Even with the brooch. There's a creepy doll tied to the pillar. And the same shoes. And the same stocking. And the same collar? I, I don't know what that's called. That's not called a collar, but it looks like a collar. <laughs> oh dear. This is where it was leading us. The boy? <laughs> Zink! <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry, Zink. So they hurriedly put the doll together, or they knew she was coming. <gasps> hey! Good thought, guy! Good thought, guy. And if they knew she was coming, they knew what she looked like. She, they knew what she'd be wearing. And she said that, sh that this place looked familiar. So she's possibly been here before. And doesn't remember. Oh! Jennifer found an old photo. It's a faded group photo taken in front of the mansion. Are we in it? I don't see it. I don't see us. Um. So, Dead's. Oh, let's let's re look at that. I thought maybe I I could flip it over. But. All right. Um. So. There, the chubby gar on the left with the curls. And then, in the back row... I'm not 100% sure who, what girl that is in the back row with the white shirt on. I guess that could be Jennifer. Because the tallest girl that I know is the one in the dead center of the back row with the dark hair and the dark shirt on that has a V-neck. It's kind of a low-cut neck. That is definitely the red-headed bitch girl. Okay, I recognize a lot of these. Oh! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Jennifer! Jennifer is Jennifer is in the middle on the right side. You can see the buckles of her shoes, right? And she's holding hands with a girl a lot smaller than her, which is probably the princess of red of the red rose or something that mentioned in the booklet. Ha! Mission solved. Cause it you can kind of see her bangs. Oh, you can see you can see my mouse. Awesome, you can see my mouse. So, it has like the little sideways swish of her bangs. She's wearing like really modest clothes like she is now. You have kind of like the signature little buckles of her shoes with the little peaky little peaky windows where you see her uh her socks. And then this looks like the same height proportions of um the girl with the red prin princess of the red rose or whatever that was her friend. Right? Zinc. <laughs> I have red hair too, Zinc. <laughs> I just don't know what... I, I call her the red-headed bitch girl because she is. She's awful. She's awful. She's terrible. And I hate her. <laughs> okay, so those are two older ladies that were probably all right all right 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 yeah yeah let me show you let me show you let me show you i'm so okay this 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 can i look at this again no i can't okay well whatever then okay what do you guys think right right that is a picture of jennifer at this orphanage when she was <gasps> when she was way younger when she was way younger, but every other girl has stayed the same? Holy shit, guys. 
Nice arc. God. <laughs> maybe girls, maybe children who don't get adopted here don't age. Maybe me and the me and the little print the little girl we're holding hands with got adopted together. Oh my god! Oh my god! That, 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 yes! I bet you! I bet! I bet! I bet! Oh my god, I'm so excited. I need to know more. I need to know more. Give me story. Give it. There's a rubbish bin tight, tight with rope. I think we're gonna get a knife later, and maybe we can... Creepy doll tied to a pillar. Yeah, that's gonna be us shortly. Okay, let's save it now that we picked up a few items. It's a creepy Neverland. Ah, I did not mean that. Overwrite. Do it. No, I can't use the book to read. I tried it a few times. All dolls are creepy. Uh, yeah, I tried to flip through the pages again, but it wouldn't let me. Which I think is dumb. Oh, here's another picture. Can I look at it? No. Okay. Oh, man, I'm so excited. I never saw that picture on my last playthrough. This place is just too huge. Oh, God. I wonder if I should be following at least a, like, a vague spoilerless walkthrough. Just to s tell me where I'm going. Or <laughs> tell me where I should go without missing anything. I definitely don't want to miss stuff. Why are you not running? Okay. We have to be systematic. We gotta check this door too. Okay, it's locked. Right. You'll never get me in a wax museum unless you drug me back to the stone age. <laughs> wax museum? But, but they don't even look like dolls, Sin. They don't even look like dolls. They look, they look really, really real. I mean, dolls that look like dolls are creepy. Can I agree with you there? Okay. Ah! There he is. Is he smiling? Whoa. Creepy little shite. Oh my gosh. Skeleton. <laughs> Skeleton in like what looks like a window? In front of this window. Actually. Oh, there's some magic going on here. Oh my god. I, I bet Jennifer was adopted from this orphanage. And, uh... Yeah, that's all the girls know her or something. I'd have died, Zink. My late grandmother used to make peekaboo... Used to make peekaboo dolls. They were a lovely gesture, but they were scary as hell. I want to know what peekaboo dolls are. Sim, my mother collects old dolls and puppets, and I grew up and was full of them. Oh. So many books! Oh, library. The library. Okay. Anything to be found? Anything to be found? Oh, Jesus! That's a dark shadow. Holy crap! Our body is like... Our shadow is, is like a black hole like no no light escapes our shadow that is a pitch black okay nothing in here at least at the moment i think i remember coming in here to see one of the girls uh, nothing literally nothing in here at the moment boring yeah i wonder what happened to the two ladies in the picture the old ladies that ran this place or the headmaster Nightstand. Dresser. Check the dresser. What? Okay. Um. Oh, shit. I lost my bearing. Oh, I came from that way. Okay. This way. I didn't... Oh, crap! I missed the cutscene because I was looking at the chat! Uh... I didn't realize just how big a two-pound jar of black bean paste would be when I ordered it. Wow, that would be huge. <laughs> what do you do? You do a lot of cooking, Ark. What do you make with bean paste? 
The cutscene was a child running up some stairs. Oh, thank you! Sin, that's super terrible and scary. What the fuck? <laughs> well, I'm gonna check these as I go. Okay. Guys, this place is huge. This is gonna be s This is gonna take forever. I'm gonna be on this playthrough for a long time. Holy shit, what have I done? Lorelei comes out this month. What have I done? The lamp is turned off. Okay. Well, let me see where I'm at in this mansion right now. I'm probably nowhere that I can understand on the bottom floor. Yes. The lamp is turned off. Oh wait, what did that say? That sign. Was there a sign? Yes, there was a sign. It says, dining room. Oh my lord. So many rooms. You do your own... You do your own cooking, but you want to make some Korean dishes involving black bean paste. Ooh, Korean food. Nice. Oh, that <laughs> sounds delicious. You just made me very hungry. <laughs> uh, okay, let's go let's go upstairs. I don't want to get lost and forget which way the boy went. You can do little bicep <laughs> curls with your bean. <laughs> Oh, wait, 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 is this a light switch? Look it! This is clearly a thing! Look, it's a light switch! Ah! Oh boy. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty funny, Zink. <laughs> oh, crap. Is this where we're gonna get- Ah! Holy shit! Will you look at this? <laughs> oh my god! Where do they get these utensils? Oh my god, this is all like dental tools. And they're all bloody! Oh my god. Jennifer found orphanage map. Holy! Thank the lord! Hallelujah! Uh, let's look at it. Oh, that's not terribly helpful, to be honest. What? It, maybe use instead? Oh, use! There we go. Reset. What I is it gonna? Oh, is it gonna be like Silent Hill, and it's gonna like mark off areas that I've looked at? First floor. Oh boy. Not the best map. Not the best map. But I will take not the best map over no map. I suppose. If I have to. Oh, here it is. What? Oh shit. I didn't mean to go in yet. I didn't mean to go in yet. Can I go back out now? Is he the prince or something? Do I remember that correctly? Can I go out? Oh, balls. Can't go out. Can't turn my camera. Oh, turn the camera. Oh boy. Okay, let's approach. I don't remember this. When the unlucky girl approached the boy, he said, my, aren't you a slow poke, like always? Here, bring me the rest of the story. You know, the book I handed you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's see. Yeah, let's see if there's any more. Oh, did I use... Oh, I c maybe I could have used it, actually. And the poor little girl was... Wait. Ah, here we go. Yeah, guys, look. Princess of the Red Rose. 
and the poor little girl was sent away to a strange house. At her new home, the aristocrat club lived by the rule of Rose, but the girl found herself very much alone. Seriously? You just, it was one page! <laughs> yeah. We will now begin the funeral. Jesus. All those attending, please gather round at this time. What are they burying? Come on, Jennifer. The funeral is about to begin. He knows our name. It's a funeral for your dear friend. <gasps> Is it the little girl? Is it the, the princess of the red rose? Before she realized it, the boy was gone. And the girl was left in confusion. Doggy! Shark! Well, we know he's okay enough to be barking. Bork, borking. Okay, let me try to pick something up from here. Maybe it wouldn't let me before, but it will now. Nope. Actually, now that I think about it, I think anything that's pick up pick upable is uh gonna sparkle. Woofer. Okay, change. See, this is what I wanted to look through before I went out. Okay, nothing. Nothing. So it said that uh, when our mother and father died. Scalpel, dental, dental forceps, gloves, scissors, there's blood all over them. Said that the, uh, the little girl that was our friend disappeared. I wonder what happened. Can I go over here? I can. Wait, is this where I came from? Is this the way out? Oh, jeez. Ugh. <laughs> Bastard. Oh, a thought. Going off what you said about Jennifer being older and everyone else being the same age as the picture, what if this is Jennifer reliving memories and they're all the same age as the photo because that's how old they were? Ah, hey. And they're just ghosts. Ah. Well, actually, that's an idea. Like, she's reliving her memories, but... You know, obviously her mind is her current age, but uh, in her memory, they're the same age they were when the memory happened. Sounds logical, because she could only remember them from before adoption. Yeah! Yeah, maybe all this is what happened. Okay, I missed a door. I'm going back for it. There isn't enough proper handling of spiders and dolls, though. Oh. What? 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 Hold on. I went out this door. Am I going mad? Ah! Oh, that's right. That's right. That's right. I did do this. <sighs> ADD's in the brain -o. So how would that fit into her uh, her story of her parents dying, and uh, she'd still sh it, the story did still say that she was sent. Do you think the dog's outside? All right, let's just head outside. Let's just head outside. We're not gonna. I don't even know how to get outside. Let's worry about that first. My dog started whining at sharks barking. Aww. What? Let's try to find a way out. That's locked. I oh, out! Yeah, shark sounds like he's outside. When the girl went out to the yard, she found a shovel standing before a grave. 
there. Well, it wouldn't it wouldn't be our little shark. Oh jeez. The unlucky girl sensed that something very dear to her was buried here. As if possessed, she began to dig furiously. No, there's no there's no way. The dog was barking. He couldn't have you wouldn't hear the dog barking if it was buried. <coughs> What is in here? Is it her old stuff? Is Shark in the photo? No. No, he's not. What is it? I wonder if it's her stuff that she left behind when she got adopted. Oh, it is actually a coffin. Oh, she's so dirty now. Oh, shit. It's the bag. Uh, they have different animals on their paper bags. Just look at you. You're filthy. <laughs> How strange. Oh my god, I would be terrified. That was abrupt. Would you like to save? Yeah. Purgatory? Life flashing before her eyes as the Zeppelin crashes? Yeah, I'm kind of wondering, was she on the Zeppelin? Was she? Was she? Was she on the Zeppelin, but she didn't die? And she's reliving this? She's reliving this kind of nightmare of when she was at the orphanage? And she's dreaming? The unlucky Cloverfield. Oh my god, I think... She only believed that she survived and the truth is being revealed to her. Interesting. <laughs> hey look, the doll was foreshadowing. <laughs> what a surprise. The water pouring made Zinc think of a baptism also. That's a good thought. Well, the idea of being dirty and filthy is going to be repeated throughout the game. Well, throughout the portion of the game that I've played. I think it has to do with that. Am I am I in control here? Oh, I am in control. Ah, just didn't look so good. When the girl awoke. She found herself in a strange room. Oh shit. Oh, everything's turned to a zeppelin now. Oh crap. Was I supposed to explore the entire mansion first? 
Oh dear. <laughs> it was cold, lonely. It was a cold, lonely, stinky room. <laughs> We're the puppet now. The water pouring seemed very ritualistic. I was partly wondering if she was being inducted into the children's society or something. If it's an afterlife thing, perhaps digging up the coffin in Jennifer's current inability to let go of the material and progress to the next existence. Um, since they buried her, maybe, maybe the pouring of water over her was supposed to be like a embalming type. Same, same idea as embalming the cleaning of the corpse before you bury it. The orphanage could be her attempt to distract herself from the fact that she's dead. Something like that. Okay. <sighs> struggle, struggle, struggle. <laughs> Let me out. Am I just supposed to <sighs> struggle until something happens? <sighs> Good morning, Jennifer. How do you feel? Let's have a little chat, shall we? <sighs> no! I'm not talking to you. Well, uh, I guess we should. Hmm. Good girl. Jennifer, you know you've been a bad, bad girl. And bad girls need to be punished, don't they? Hmm. A bad, bad girl who's not sorry, hmm? Anyway, I'll be the one giving the orders around here, okay? <sighs> um, no. <sighs> Silly girl. You still don't understand. Well, you will before long. No, I suppose I don't. Now, I'm going to give you your first order. Every month you need to find a gift and bring it to the aristocrat club. If you don't, I'll kill you. Is there anything about this that you don't understand? <laughs> Is there anything about this that you don't understand? Uh, thank you for the donation, Mr. Mike Litteris. And I'm not going to do that. That's horrible. Tell, tell Ark that the message on the donation says, tell Ark that both his art and waifu are trash. And that is very mean. I would not do such a thing. It's very cruel. <clears throat> is there anything about this that you don't understand? Yes! There's a yes. lot I don't understand for fuck's sake. Hmm. Everything! Oh well, it doesn't really matter what you say. You see, Jennifer... There are really only two kinds of people in the world. Those who take orders, and those who give them. And from now on, I'll be giving the orders. Not fair? No, not fair. Well, dear Jennifer, nothing's fair here. <laughs> you will follow my orders or else. <laughs> For I am the prince, and the prince rules. <laughs> this is your life, but you'll play by my rules. <laughs> what a little shit. Let the games begin, dear Jennifer. <laughs> Huh. He's grounded once I find him. Shit. Jesus, just one mis <laughs> just just a slight misalignment and there goes like a hand. The rope was cut. Snip snip. Congratulations. Congratulations. Now, the bag that was 
Foul-smelling laundry baskets sit on the shelf. Dirty clothes are stuffed inside them. See, just let's let's keep this in mind. This repeating. <laughs> Ark. Ark has donated five dollars. Appreciated, and he would like me to tell Mike Litteris to meet him outside after the stream. Yeah, Ark, stand up for yourself. Don't let people talk to you that way. The scissors are just out of her reach. Uh, let's let's keep in like let's try to keep track of all the times that like dirtiness or the idea of being bad is mentioned in the game. Don't let anyone talk to you like that, Ark. As the girl looked at the rubbish bin, it spoke to her. My belly is dark as night and as deep as the abyss. Anything in the world that is dropped will be collected inside it. Oh, that's right. This is a holder of things. Any item you collect can be stored in this rubbish bin. If you can't find a bin, just select an item from the menu screen and select drop. And the item will be stored here. There's no need to worry about losing it. <gasps> oh! I can literally just drop any item anywhere and it'll be stored here. That's pretty nice. About to dry off Mike with these hands. <laughs> nice. Water was poured all over. Chat is... What? I'm so confused. I guess she was? Okay, so... There's stock and item. Um... Maybe? Uh, let's store the photo. I don't think we're going to need to use that for anything. Orphanage map will keep. The little princess book. I don't think we need with us. Alright. Bucket. When the girl examined the bucket, it pleaded. Lass, please put me back atop my body. Oh, it's a bucket night! Back on top of the headless scarrow behind you. Scarrow? Scarecrow. <laughs> if you do, I'll help you in return. Jennifer found bucket. Let's help out poor little headless bucket night. As the girl placed the bucket in its proper place, it spoke. I am the Bucket Knight, Keeper of Promises. Yet, time can be so cruel, for I have aged and cannot remember the past. You know what I refer to, and I know that you know. However, you do not know at the moment, nor can you remember. Let us recall our memories together, in order to remember our promise. Story hints. When you aren't sure how to proceed, talk to Bucket Knight and select Ask for Clues in order to receive a hint about what to do next. You said Bucket and I have... <laughs> Jeez, Ark. Filthy! You're filthy! If you don't want to do something, put it in the fucking bucket. <laughs> With that bucket head, uh, he'd be making a pretty good guitarist. Uh, receive a hint about what to do next. What is it that you seek? Let's save first. We don't have to redo that uh, cutscene. Oh, I could always go back and explore the mansion a little bit more and then come forward, huh? I could. I could do so. I very well could. Poor, helpless, unlucky girl. Tell me your tale. Ask for clues. I just want to see what he says. If memory serves me correctly... The order you've been given is the reason you are here. It may be unpleasant, yet you have no choice but to follow it. A tribute to the aristocrat, uh, aristocrat club. That's your only clue. Okay. I think I remember what it is. Uh, I need to reach that. Scissors are just out of her reach. Huh. How do I get that down? I want those scissors. 
Uh, bucket, okay. Nothing else in there. Anything I can use right here. The, the bag that I was buried with isn't in here, I suppose. Wait, here's the coffin. Yes! Oh, there's a big wooden box covered with, a, with dirt and grass. The sack inside it is covered in animal hair. <gasps> oh, it was shark. It was shark friend. But it's empty, which is a good sign. Oh lord, cargo bay. Ugh. Maybe I should have uh, explored the mansion completely thoroughly before I uh, followed the boy. Ah! Oh. Ya little bastard! What's this say? You are invited to the Aristocrat Club, Red Crayon Society. Oh, Red Crayon Aristocrats. Sorry. Oh, I know this guy's gonna jump at me. I remember it. Oh! Oh! I was wrong! Bre broom closet. Ah! ah! Oh, you s- Okay. I know we're gonna actually be turning into some combat soon. Nobody's around. Oh, a rat! Oh, maybe that's the rat we get to cuddle. Oh, there's a butterfly right there. I think we use that. Mut, 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 mut. You invited to okay, maybe this is that's maybe it's telling us where to go. Okay. Is this just another hallway just parallel to the one that we were at? There's a save you can go back to if needed, right? Yes, it is. This is a talking bucket <laughs> that makes you a bit awkward. <laughs> uh, okay, so this is not a hallway. So these brooms. Oh! It is telling us where to go. The arrow points up the stairs. Middle class luggage. Okay, everything is locked. My goodness! My goodness! Well, okay. Uh, since we only have about 10 minutes left to the stream, let's just head on over to the aristocrat, the aristocrat, whatever. Ah, yes, yes, okay, here, here, this is important. Red crayon royalty. There's the red rose princess. Hey, that was our friend, remember? In the booklet, that was our dear friend, red rose, the princess of the red rose. Bear prince, this is, this is the hierarchy. Then you have Duchess, Countess, Baroness. Take a look at their take a look at their hairstyles. I wonder if that tells you who has what rank. They appear to all be on the same level. Bourgeoisie, poor, and beggar. Oh jeez. It's pretty brutal. <clears throat> I'm betting we start at the very bottom. Plant! What a lovely plant. What? I didn't mean to... Mm. I was just admiring the plant. Okay, what's this say? The rule of gifts. Find a gift of the month. All members much must participate. Tardiness, stealing, and cheating are prohibited. Junk, toys, and more. No refunds, only exchange. Red crayon aristocrat. Uh, and then where is it? Sick bay? Sick room? Oh, here we go. We're flying! 
Looking through the window, the unlucky girl saw that she was above the clouds. The airship slowly swam through the sky, carrying the helpless girl inside. Hmm? Oh, flip! Flip, leg camera! Flip. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well... Now, so we need to come up with a gift. Oh, is that another sign? Or just a painting? What is this? That says VIP room. Can we go in here? I suppose not, since we are probably the beggar. Even without authority figures, they're pretty big on hierarchy. Uh, I never should have figured children would come up short. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I hear giggle giggle. I want my shark. Oh, here. This is what I was looking for. The girl has found a strange door, but where does it lead? This month's gis gift, one per person. Check the box. A strange box is attached to the door. Things can be placed inside it. Read the poster. This month's gift. Oh, a beautiful butterfly, one per person. Oh, we saw a butterfly in the uh, cargo hold. Open the door. And we don't have anything to make an offering with, so... As the unlucky girl stood helplessly, the door spoke. Give me a beautiful butterfly, one per person. Is that clear? No gift, no entry. Is that clear? Give me a butterfly. Give me a butterfly. Find one, and you shall be invited to join the aristocrat club. Oh, okay, so maybe I wasn't. Now the children are laughing creepy. Great. <laughs> right? Okay, so we... I don't... I don't... Moon's small leaf tea. Okay. Well. Whoa. Oh. Aha. Did you see what I see? We have a list of titles. I knew it. We are the beggar. Social rank refined class. Duchess Diana. Countess Eleanor. Baroness, Meg. Lower class. Poor, Amanda. Beggar, Jennifer. Jeez. We really are the bottom of the bottom. Wasn't it Eek the cat that had a dog named Sharky? What? That sounds really familiar. Oh my gosh, I completely forgot Eek the cat was a thing. Okay, we're gonna head back to the bucket night. We're gonna save it, and then we're gonna end the stream. And we'll save the rest of it for next time. We know where we're gonna be getting our uh, butterfly from. We need to find, uh, we need to find Shark. We need to find our dog, who is a, psh, a man. If anybody was lower on the totem pole than us, it would be Shark. Butterfree! Oh, it's Amanda. Hmm. 
Uh, butterfly ran away, so apparently we're gonna need to find it again now. Uh, okay, so we're still heading back. And then we also need to find something for us to be able to reach... Child! Child! Kick him in the face! He's just gonna slam it shut, isn't he? We need something to uh, reach the scissors. The plastic lid of the black bean paste jar is cracked, and there is paste getting everywhere. Oh my god! It's a paste-based catastrophe. No. Poor helpless unlucky girl. Tell me your tale. What is it you seek? I seek to save. Let's save here. We'll save over our last one because I don't think we'll need to do anything before. Uh, I don't think we mi could have missed anything. Everything was locked. All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Our stream for today has come to an end. Thank you very much for joining me. I hope you guys are excited about this new series and you're enjoying it so far. It is going to be a pretty long series because um, there's going to be a lot of exploring. There's like a lot of puzzles and stuff that you have to figure out what you're supposed to do next. And they'll probably be a little bit time consuming. And we're still going to do our usual analysis of what's going on around us and of the story and plot line and everything like that. And the characters, of course, too. That's probably like second most important. So uh, I will see you guys again on Thursday, hopefully, as long as I'm not sick again, <laughs> which I don't anticipate being. You guys have a wonderful day, and I'll catch you next time.